something bad happened here. It seems deserted. Malaya, where are you? Malaya! You came, Casty. What were you doing here? You're asking the wrong question. You should instead be asking, what happened here? Does the word Santanejo mean anything to you? It was a flower of great importance to heirs apothecaries. Santanejo. <laughs> Good, Casty. It's finally time to remember. I'll even lend a hand. Our story starts two years ago. It was a summer filled with the fragrance of green. The season of clouds and rain was right around the bend. Mm. Am I going to die? No, you're gonna live. Help is coming. Just hold on. You're faster than expected. How is he, Malaya? In a great deal of pain, but lucid. I've patched him up as best I could. We were right to keep him here for observation. Here, Lind. This should ease your suffering. Pull strong, breathing steady, good. Thanks. I'll be able to climb up and fix that darned roof for sure now. <laughs> Easy there, old timer. Learn your limits. You're not climbing anything. A leaky roof won't kill you, but recklessness will. You worry about getting better. I'll worry about those repairs. Casty, really? Carpentry isn't our vocation. <laughs> but that won't stop our mother hen here. She just can't resist clucking over her charges. No teasing. Oh, where's Trousseau? Sorry I'm late. I had to see an unexpected patient. Speak of the devil, dear. Welcome back, Trousseau. Who was this patient? Sally. She fainted, so I went to see what was wrong. I administered to her, and she seemed stable for the time being. Here, my notes. Though, I'm still concerned for her. I'd like to follow up on her soon. <laughs> I'm not surprised to hear that. You care more about your patients than any other apothecary I've met, Trousseau. That's the heart of what it means to be a healer. To extend a helping hand to all those in need. Casty's creed and words to live by. It was the force of her spirit that brought us all together. That creed's what makes our order special. I appreciate the kind words, everyone. But no working yourselves into the ground. Let's all take a break, yes?
Thank you. That was very helpful. That was very helpful. Randy was just teaching me how to look after Jaya here. He was? Uh-huh. Jaya's just such a sweetie, isn't that right? <laughs> it must be nice to be so loved, Jaya. Randy, how are you and Andy getting along? My brother's insufferable. We feud as often as not. I only wish that knucklehead had as much brain as he did Ron. If he was as clever as Malaya... <laughs> He'd be a force indeed. Still, it was thanks to his verve that you're standing here, yes? Yeah, guess I owe him for that. I suppose Andy's got at least one good quality, huh? You two make a wonderful team. That was very helpful. That was very helpful. Thank you. I was just about to head up to Lynn's roof, see what I could do. Thanks for handling that for me, Andy. <laughs> no need for thanks. Leave the muscle work to me. I got the brawn for it. <laughs> you certainly do. Well, off with you then. That was very helpful. Thank you. Thank you. That was very helpful. Thank you. Sally. Right as rain, and playing up a storm. I was a fool for worrying over nothing. There's no shame in feeling concerned for a patient. In fact, I believe your empathy is your greatest strength. <sighs> Thank you. Well, guess I'll check up on some of our other patients. That should about do it. Everyone seems to be doing well. Now to my last job for the day, sorting through all these patient notes. Help! Tem? Who's shouting? What's all this ruckus about? His face is as pale as a ghost. What happened, Tem? It's Sally! She... she suddenly fainted! I yelled and yelled, but, but she wouldn't wake up! Could you take me to her, Tem? We'll all go. Let me take a look, Trousseau. This swelling on her forehead... It wasn't there before. Some catalyst must have exacerbated her injury after you left. There's no way you could have predicted this, Trousseau. <sighs> we'll need medicine to reduce the swelling. Wait, you don't mean Santanejo, do you? Santanejo blossoms? Those flowers that grow on the summit of Mount Lithia? 
That place is rife with monsters. It's too dangerous for anyone. Hold it, Trousseau. Where are you off to? Flower picking, I presume. Please don't. You'll just end up another patient. We have medicine that can help with her condition. It won't do much, but we should try it first and see. But Santanejo Blossoms are the only thing that can save her for certain. If she can be saved, I want to do it. With my own hands. Wait, that's... Malaya, you and the others use what salves you have on hand. Keep her stable until we return. Trousseau and I will go gather the blossoms we need. Chief... Hold it! There's caring for patients, and then there's risking your life. You can't... No, Andy. I can, and I must. I share Trousseau's feelings. This child's life is on the line, and we must do all we can for her. <sighs> Those are the Chief's orders, Andy. We'll do everything we can to keep her alive, Casty. Just be safe out there. Thank you, Malaya. That's it! We can save her with this. Stay strong, Trousseau. Drink this. It's bitter as sin. But it will refresh you. Skybomb? You never fail to impress. How'd you know we'd need it? <laughs> I never leave home without it. You all push yourselves too hard. Yes, we do. By the way, why'd you support my decision back there? It was your spirit that motivated me. That earnest desire to save a life. You showed empathy and kindness. As a fellow apothecary, it felt right to encourage that in you. <laughs> there you go again, with that mother hen routine. It is our purpose to extend a helping hand to all those in need. It was that creed, your creed, that brought me here. You changed my destiny. I became an apothecary to cure my sister's illness. A malady said to be incurable. I studied for years and years. And in the end, my efforts were for naught. I watched her die in front of my very eyes. Yet, on her deathbed, she said this to me. Though my life could not be saved, your hands are those of a healer. Help those in need. Trousseau. There. We have the blossoms we need. Let's take them to Sally, Chief. She's waiting for us to heal her. And so we return safely to Sally's side. The Santanejo blossoms in hand. We saved her life that day. Santanejo. Trousseau and I collected those flowers together. He was the gentlest of us all. 
and the purest of heart. Yeah, that's right. Too pure by half. It's what made it easier for the darkness to find a hold. And stain it with evil. What? Search your memories, Casty. You're almost there. Where are you going, Malaya? The town square. Come find me when you're ready. <laughs> 